miles per hour in just three seconds, obtained from just six single leaps. The cheetah is undoubtedly a relentless king of speed, making it the fastest creature on land. This title has been defended by the cheetah for at least 11 million years, capable of running up to speeds of approximately 75 miles per hour. The most incredible aspect of the cheetah's speed is acceleration, an optimal performance in acceleration, which most sports cars are still yet to obtain. Weighing in about 60 kilograms, the cheetah chooses speed over weight and stamina, with males being slightly larger than females. The body of a cheetah is covered in short tan fur with black spots, which helps it blend in with its surroundings and remain camouflaged. The cheetah is a large slender-bodied cat that belongs to the cat family Felidae, with its scientific name called Asinonis jubatus. Cheetahs have a unique number of physical aerodynamic features that allows them to run at incredible speeds. One of the most notable of these is their long, slender body shape. Cheetahs have a flexible spine and a small rounded head that is supported by powerful neck muscles. This allows them to turn their head quickly and easily, which is important when hunting fast-moving prey. Cheetahs also have long, powerful legs that are designed for speed. They have a unique gait, with both legs on one side of their body moving forward at the same time, followed by the legs on the other side, and a long tail that aids in swift maneuvering. This creates a characteristic bounding motion that is efficient for running at high speeds. To accelerate, only one foot is in contact with the ground at a time. They have a unique anatomy on their legs, with elongated metatarsal bones that act like springs providing extra power and energy to each stride. They also have large powerful tire muscles that drive their legs forward, helping them to maintain their top speed for longer periods of time. The cheetah is the only member of the cat family that doesn't possess the capability to retract its claws, providing more traction. Another unique feature of the cheetah is its large nostrils and lungs. This allows it to take in a lot of air when running which is important for delivering oxygen to its muscles. Cheetahs also have a large heart and a high blood volume, which allows them to deliver oxygen to their muscles more efficiently. Interestingly, the cheetah is also one of the few big cats that hunts during the day. This is likely due to the fact that the cheetah's speed and agility gives it a distinct advantage over most of its prey, which are not adapted to outrun a predator at such high speeds. By hunting during the day, the cheetah is able to take advantage of the sun's heat, which causes many prey species to slow down and become more vulnerable to attack. With distinctive black tear tracks that run from the corner of each eye to their mouth, the cheetah is naturally endowed with anti-glare filter protection, an excellent and necessary tool needed for daytime hunting. While cheetahs are known for their speed, they are not particularly powerful animals in terms of biting force. According to a zoological research, cheetahs have a maximum bite force of around 475 pounds per square inch. This is much lower than the other big cats such as lions and tigers. This relatively weak bite force is due to the cheetah's elongated skull and smaller jaw muscles. While this may seem like a disadvantage, it is actually an adaptation that allows the cheetah to have a large nasal cavity which is important for taking a lot of air when running. Cheetahs also have a unique hunting strategy that allows them to maximize their speed. When hunting, cheetahs will stalk their prey until they are within 100 yards. Once a suitable prey has been identified, the cheetah will begin to approach slowly, taking care to remain hidden from view. When it is within a striking distance, they will then begin to sprint reaching top speeds of up to 75 miles per hour. During this sprint, cheetahs can cover distances of up to 460 meters in just a few seconds, leaving no chances of escape for the prey. Once they catch their prey, cheetahs will typically suffocate it with a bite to the throat. But this immense chase comes with a disadvantage. After each sprint, cheetahs need about 30 minutes to recover and regain energy meaning they cannot eat immediately after a hunt. 
leaving their fresh kill exposed to scavengers, lions, vultures, hyenas, and jackals. Despite its incredible speed, the cheetah is not without its predators. Cheetahs also face competition from other predators, lions and hyena typically, which always steal their kills and pose a threat to their young ones. Additionally, cheetahs are also genetically vulnerable to disease, particularly when living in close proximity to domesticated livestock. Namibia, a small country in Africa, has the largest population of cheetahs in the world. Whereas the cheetah is the fastest sprinter, the pronghorn is the fastest long-distance runner in the animal kingdom, capable of maintaining a speed of 45 miles per hour over several miles. Cheetahs are found in open grasslands and savannas, where they hunt fast-moving prey, especially gazelles, impalas, and springboks. In these environments, speed is essential for survival. Prey animals have evolved to be fast and agile, and predators must equally be fast and agile to catch them. Cheetahs have evolved to be the fastest land predator in the environment. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more science videos.